Hey everybody, safety is number one priority. And for this experiment, we're gonna need a pin, or like a needle, and a bottle of water. All right, and this experiment, I'll show you how to punk somebody. Guess what will happen if I make a hole in the bottle? It's probably will leak out, right? Yes, it will leak out, but that will stop. Why will it stop? Because the atmosphere pressure will not let the water go away. So on the same level, we're gonna make a bunch of holes. You have to be on the same level. If you do it higher, that will not work. So just let's do a bunch of holes. So once you've done a bunch of holes and leave it somewhere on the table, it's not gonna leak out as long as it's the holes are on the same level. Once somebody picks it up, and push a little bit of pressure of, on the bottle to open it, guess what's gonna happen? It's gonna spray them. Or if they open, you see it starts spilling out. And once you close it, it will stop spilling out. Yeah, check it out. Once you open, it starts spilling. You see? And once you open, like the oxygen to come in and, on, on top of the bottle, it will stop spill out. So if you press it, it spill out too. Check it out, pretty funny. And for this experiment, we're gonna need water, pepper, empty plate and dish salt. Alright, first we're gonna pour water in the plate. You want the pepper that will float and the, don't put too much. Yeah, you see those big leaves. So you see how it's all floating on top of a water. So you soap one finger, you see it's kind of soapy. So if we stick a finger, see it's pushing out because I have soap on my finger. And let's see it without soap. And this is what happens without soapy finger. Nothing much happens, you see? And for this experiment we're gonna need water, film canister and a tablet of Alka-Seltzer. We're gonna put two tablets, fill it up all the way. Drop these two tablets. Close it real quick and turn it over. So I'm gonna close it and oh, what a fail! And for this experiment, we're gonna need water, the balloon, the lighter, and a candle. First, we're gonna put some water in the balloon. All right, we got full balloon of water, but this balloon haven't been blow up. The next, we're gonna blow up this balloon. And then we're gonna tie it up. And then we're gonna need to light up the candle. So as you can see, the water inside the balloon, if you put the balloon over the fire, it's supposed to burst, right? But it doesn't. Check it out. This is just burn spot because of water. You know what happening? The water distributing the heat so the balloon doesn't pop because of that. The water might be like a little warmer now, but check it out, it just doesn't pop. And let's try this other balloon, place it over the fire without water. Check it out. Right away, it blows up. Today I'm gonna show you cool paper clip take. All you're gonna need is a cup of water and few paper clips. So you challenge somebody to put a paper clip on top of water so it will float. Most people will put it like that and it will sink. Or they're gonna try to drop it and it will sink too. The take is fold one paper clip, put the other paper clip on top of it and just carefully put it on top of water and it will float. Guess why? You're using this thing so you don't break the water tension and you see how it's all kind of water puffed up. For this stick we're just gonna need a card and the coin. So this stick is really cool. You put a card on top of your finger and the coin on top of your finger after all. And challenge somebody to remove the card without touching the coin. So and this is very simple take. All you do is flick the card on a corner like that. 
So you did not touch the coin, but they moved the card. For this experiment, we're gonna need three matches and the match box. We're gonna make a hole in the box and stick the match like this. Then we're gonna put the coin on top of a box and then place a match on top of a coin and lean it next to the other match. And then you're gonna challenge your friend to remove the coin without making the matches fall down. Well, the solution for this thing is grab another match and strike it and just light this match right here. Guess what is going to happen? You did not touch the match and you can take the coin. And, you co and the coin is yours now since they won the bet. For this thing you're going to need a bottle, a dollar bill and then like a bunch of quarters. Put a dollar on top of a bottle and put coins on top of a dollar. And challenge somebody to remove the dollar bill without I'm removing the coins, you know, so you, you see, fail. So here's the solution for that. You moisten your finger and go like that from here to bottom, real quick motion. And you see coins are still there and dollar is yours. So is your quarters, because that's what you bet for. Today I'm gonna show you cool illusion. Grab a stack of papers, roll it up, like, so you have like a hole like that. and. Look to it, place it to, next to your eye, eye, and then put your hand like almost to the end of the tube and just look to it. And what you're gonna see is it looks like uh, you have a hole in your hand. It's a pretty cool illusion. You guys check it out. Let me know what do you think. Experiment with that. So first fold it in half like this, then open it, then fold it in half like this. Make sure all your cases are similar. Then turn it over and fold it in half like that. Then once you're gonna open it, you see how, how it's like folding almost by itself. Just bring these two corners together and close it. And you know, make it tight over here. Yeah, that's what she said. Now, fold these flaps, all four of them on top, one, two, they don't have to be too precise, but do as, uh, you know, as tight as you can, you know what I mean? All four of them like this. So next you're gonna fold these pieces right here in the middle. Like that. Turn it over. Do same thing here. Should have all every corner should look similar. Then you got on this side four pieces right here. One, two, three, four. And on this side is like solid. So we're gonna grab it and fold it like that. You see by that corner out. All four of them again. Hope you guys follow. Hope it's not too fast. I'm sorry if it's too fast. You can pause it and catch up to, with me. You know, pause the video, fold it, each fold and you know catch up with me okay you got it like that then fold this piece into here all flops like that all of them and now you have like all the pieces like that is folded so we got pockets right here you're gonna open it and stick, in the, and stick them in and the same same again with all four of them open it stick it in make it tight and same thing here you 
as you can see this flap was out here open it stick it in and pack it uh, like just like that pretty easy huh and we're done and now you're gonna have a hole over here you're just gonna blow in there 